Marcus Conti reporting on his last day on the job. So, this is a hard video to make. I had this revelation. You know, actually watching the Super Bowl, I realized that sitting there watching the Super Bowl, eating popcorn, and I realized that, that I had been wrong about everything. Right? I just wanted to help. I wanted to... I wanted to help, help America. You know? Spread some of, some of the truth I thought... I thought was truth. But it turns out... You know, just watching, watching the, the game and, and, you know, the American spirit that I was wrong. I was wrong about so much. I mean, the wars, you know. How dare me say that the, that the United States would engage in bad war and false war, right? Guatemala, 1954. Cuba, 61. How, how, who am I to say that those are interventionists? That, that, that the United States was exerting its will wrongfully. Who am I to say that? The United States is always right. War is peace. 1964, Brazil. 1965, Dominican Republic. 73, Chile. 76, Argentina. Grenada. Panama in 89. Haiti in 94. The first try in Venezuela. 2002, 2009, Honduras. We're back 2019, Venezuela again. Libya, Iraq, Syria. America is, is a great country. We're doing, that's, we're spreading democracy. I, I was wrong. I was wrong. War is peace. I don't know how to... I don't know how I reconcile that, but war is peace. The elections are real. I was wrong. The elections are real. The exit polls not matching by 12%. Millions of people's votes not counted. I thought I saw what I saw, but I didn't. I was wrong. I made a mistake. 200,000 people here in Brooklyn purged off the rolls. America is a great country. We have integrity. And we, should, we believe the media is always right. right. The media is always right. Ignorance is strength. When, when the media says it, that's our government telling the media that everything is right. That this is the way it's supposed to be. There was no fraud. There was no... No money laundering at the DNC. That was my mind. That was my reckless, my, my reckless liberal mind running astray. That's what it was. Right? It had to have been, right? Exit polls, voting machines, they work. They're not, they're not broken. They're not, they're not rigged. They're not owned by private companies. That shit is all, all re real. Who, where was, what was I thinking? I don't know, man. I don't know. I'll find something to do with my life, but this kind of truth telling, it doesn't seem that I can actually, that I don't understand the truth. And, and here I am professing to people into a YouTube audience the truth, according to me, and it turns out to be all all, all nonsense, untruth. I repent. False flags. There's no such thing. False flags. What an accusation that I made. I, I, I apologize. That that uh, you know Caesar Syac was was fake. That he was a that he was a uh, that that was a setup. Or borderline borderline bar shooting. That those twelve people weren't heroic. And died heroically. Sandy Hook, Las Vegas. 
Jenny Moore. Jenny Moore died because Bill Clinton, exposing Bill Clinton, that's ridiculous. Right? She died. She died. I don't know why she died, to be honest. <laughs> but what else? What else was I wrong about? I was wrong about so much. I tried to write it down. Oh, Wall Street is very honest. Wall Street never lies. Wall Street wants your wants to make you money. Wall Street doesn't inside a trade. Uh, 99% of Wall Street is they're wonderful people. They really are. They they are wonderful suit wearing family people that deserve our utmost respect and we shouldn't feel bad about giving them all our money. Because that's what they do. That's what they've always done, right? Wall Street is good. <sighs> Banks, multinational corporations. Banks are good. That's where you should put your money. You put your money in the bank. And the bank holds it for you. For a rainy day. Right? They always have you. They'll lend you money if you, if you need it. Well, if you, if you, you know, if you debt yourself, then that's you. You're stupid and lazy. Right? See, the media is always right. The media, I mean, I was watching today, and, and they were, they're saying that Venezuela, the people of Venezuela want freedom, and that their evil leader is a tyrant and a socialist, and he has to go, just like all the other places, Nicaragua, Honduras. Chile. Right, so I'm wrong again. I mean, I can't go on just being wrong all the time, right? It's just, there's no, what's the point of it all? What's the point of always being wrong in the face of righteousness, right? Who am I helping by doing that? Am I just an egomaniac doing that, saying, you know, Speaking a truth that isn't truth at all, that's, that's like double talk. People are just lazy, that's, that's it. I mean, I think, I think the media is, the media has got to be right. That people can't get by in this world, in this country. Half the people are in, in poverty because they're lazy and they're stupid. And they just, they just won't work. They won't work harder. They won't give more of themselves. And billionaires deserve every penny they get. You see, like, the system is not rigged. The system is, the system is what it is, right? And, and because, just because they're at the top of the heap, that doesn't give you the right to criticize them. They're wonderful people, the billionaire class. They're wonderful. They, they, they made their mark in America. And they, they should be honored, and, and, and we should be proud to serve them. Right? See, I was wrong again. War is peace. Freedom is slavery. Ignorance is strength. 